Hey guys, welcome back to uh, the second part of my chopper tutorial videos. Um, I'd just like to thank you all very much for uh, for all the views I got on the first uh, the first part there. So cheers for that. Um, this next section, I'm going to be covering on how to to deal with tanks uh, when the the recent patch came out. Um, it made them a little bit hard, a little bit tougher to get to, and also. Um, to deal with with um, shots like this. Now with tank drivers becoming better gunners and also throwing into the mix the slight armor upgrade um, with the with the tanks you've got to you've got to attack it a different way so I think I found the solution to it so um, see what you think. Carefully it's a tank. Whoa I'll stay over the top of him you do some damage on him mate. Guy's got out as well. You got him, you got him. Yeah, there's a. Where the hell's that coming from? The uh, tanks, too. Get rid of yours. Alright. Right, right I'll get over the top of them, yeah. Which one are we going for? Let's go for this one. Left. Again. Did you get him? Yeah, got him. Let's go for this one now. I'll get over the top of him. Do some damage on him there. Come on, I need that auto leave me loaded. It's too slow when it's not on. Oh, that's not easy enough. You got him? Yeah. B, C, someone locking onto us. There he is, there. There's the tank there, laser on. Yeah. I'll get over the top of him, you damage yeah. him. Keep away from that bloody big gun of his. I'll try and do a bit of strafing if I can. Oh, he's shitting it, he's shitting it. Got him. Nice one over there. Is that a tank? Is that a tank that ain't gone? Right, we whoa, LAV's on us. Try and stay low over there. Uh, it's tank's gone. Tank's dead. Can't, can't see the LAV. Where the fuck is it? I know, it's a nightmare. Oh, yeah, there he is. Okay, so I think that's pretty self-explanatory. Uh, just stay over the top of um, of the tanks. Uh, once you've uh, you've come in, you've took a few shots at it. Get your gunner over the top of it. Let him do the damage. If you can do a bit of strafing uh, as you're pointing down and circling the target, all well and good. But if not, just let your gunner finish the target. That's all you need to do. This next one is um, map. Carg Island and this one covers cover spots and also a bit of a surprise for me in this one uh, so it shows a tactic that I like to do. Carg Island now, one of my favourite maps on here. Uh, it's quite a small map, um, there's quite a bit of coverage in here uh, whereby you've got the buildings down near the flag areas and uh, quite a lot of the rock cover. Uh, so we'll uh, we'll get in the chopper and I'll just show you a few of my uh, places I like to duck around while uh, incoming missiles are coming my way. Right, so one of the, uh, my favourite moves on this map is actually going behind, uh, getting behind the enemy and uh, just down here there's a perfect place for attacking uh, unsuspecting targets really. You've got your choppers, they don't expect it, uh, especially the AA guns which are a dreaded nightmare on this map. Because everywhere you go they seem to be there. But if you go this way, you get yourself behind the target, you can get right round to the back of one. We're over here now, in the middle of the map, quite near the spawn. I don't like spawn, uh, spawn camping and things like that, so I don't do it. But as you come over, you've got all around this footage here, right in front of you where, uh, where jets come. Uh, so you can pop up on the jets there as well. This main one 
right here that you can stick it in a hover here. And if you've got a gunner on board, you can have a good look round both of you just to see what's going on. See what you can spot around this area. And like I say, most of them will be facing towards the uh, the flags. So you've got a good run on anything that's at the top, top of B, around that area. A lot of snipers and things like that that you can pick up. A lot of the tanks coming up on this road. A lot of the tanks waiting here, so that's perfect. And also you've got attacking on here, the air target. Now, uh, looks like there's somebody else on this map here, so I might get attacked, so we'll see how it goes. Um, right, so we've got that there. Also, if you're in the mood, I don't really like doing it, but sometimes you've got to do it to try and win the uh, to try and win the uh, the map. If you want to capture E flag, there's some good covering positions here. If you're on the uh, the US side, just down here, land your bird. You've got coverage there from the base over there quite well covered though. Yeah, you'll have tanks and uh, AA guns maybe there, but you're out of the cockpit. If you both get out of there, your chopper's the not spotted. Russian side, if you're on the Russia, Russian side, you've got the Havoc. Get in here. Land it here. Even better coverage this side. Full choppers covered on that side there, so that's a good little point. Now, as for missiles and, uh, and lock-ons, oh, here we go. Sounds like an AA got to me, so we'll move out of way. I also jump off this server, guys, and uh, try and find one that's. Uh, so we can spot him on from that area. You've expected this. I'm trying to do a little bit and we get attacked. There he is. This is a bit of a coverage here, coverage spot, I like to get down. Nice coverage for you. We'll just try this move that was on about. <coughs> See if we can spot or not. I don't know how many's on here, let's just have a quick look. Two of us. So obviously he's not in the mood for attacking in a play. Or a, uh, a chopper. So let me see if we can spot him. If I'm not spotted up, you won't know where I am. <laughs> Let's have a look if we can see him. Anybody see him? Right, obviously he's on air somewhere. There he is. Getting out, he's pretty injured, isn't he? He's not as injured as me. Let's see if we can get him. There he is. He's dead. 
So yeah, so I've just proved to you there that that actually worked. Just coming over the uh, the hilltop there. Good scenario. So just before he comes back on, you've got the coverage around the buildings. Uh, you've got the cover coverage around the uh, the oil drums, things like that. This is nice coverage. You can fly nice and low. You've also got down the main streets here as well. All right, sea area. These aren't bad coverage spots as long as there's no RPGs in these buildings here, which is an absolute friggin' nightmare. But uh, all around the map, we've got round the side of this island to cover, as I've just shown. So uh, hopefully, yeah, you'll do well on that. Right, we'll cut to the next map. Cheers, guys. So yeah, nice surprise there for me. Weren't expecting an LAV to turn up, a uh, guy on the map. So yeah, added bonus for me, uh, my footy sir for you. Uh, right, the next uh, thing I want to show you is how to deal with uh, LAVs. And um, basically it's to take them out at long range if possible. Cheers. I'm going to try and take them out at this Bailed out. Oh, it's fucking my thing's gone on it anyway. Miles away from me. Oh, I'm getting hits on it still. The top is moving. Yeah, I'll try it now, right? Oh, is he behind some of No. He is. Oh. Is he? Yeah, no. He's injured, he's injured, he's injured. Badly. Yeah, he's disabled. Finish him. He's bailed out. Did you get him? No, I didn't get him. He's still knocking about somewhere. I've got driver assist, are you sure? No, I've got the kill. There he is, he's running, he's running to... Say no, that, that's his spot. Say that, no, he, he ran into his own spawn. Yeah, so if you're in a position to actually take them out at long range, um, it's a good idea to, to give it a try. Uh, it's a lot harder to line the crosser up. Uh, if you noticed, I was struggling a little bit, just trying to get the uh, the crosser right there. Um, it is a lot better to try and take them from afar at a distance, because as you know, the uh, the turret on the LAV, it can uh, basically do a 360, so you're, you're knacked. So yeah, hope you enjoyed that one. Cheers. So the next map for cover spots and tactics is uh, going to be Work Island. So I'll leave you with that one. Cheers. Okay, guys. On this one, um, I'll show you a few um, spots where I, I normally get to cover. Uh, there's not that many round here, uh, apart from down on the side of the islands itself. Uh, but I'll also show you some some little tactics that we use. Especially when Nomad's got his, his TV missile on, which is quite a good uh, good little tactic actually. Uh, right, so right on this one, what I normally use for cover is um, obviously the, uh, the the side of the the island itself get some locks on and you're pretty much down here all the way down nice and low nice and low you've also got this here which you can go under but your main your main ones are here all round this all round the island you can do this for stops good locks no matter what position you are if you're at, if you're over any any type of, uh, of flag you get a lock on make sure you bail out 
Get over here. Get down. Missiles will just smack into these. That's pretty much it on here. Uh, you've got your buildings, obviously. You know, buildings for cover, but they are quite difficult to uh, to stop the missiles coming in. It is an open map. Now the um, the tactic that we use quite a bit actually is on um, is on D. We're coming in normally quite low, and you know you've got the AA gun, uh, the LAV just over there. But you come in quite low there and lift up. Nomak always sets his TV off, and it hits it, and then you can pop back up finish it off. And you can do that at a distance as well. Which I'll repeat just over here. So if you're coming in from that side of the island over to this side he's ready with his TV pop up let him shoot it off finish it off. And that just about wraps it up guys. Thanks very much for watching my second part of my tutorial there. I hope you found uh, interesting things in there for you. Um, I have got other footage as well. If you'd like me to upload it, just put it in the comments below um, of the other maps on here. You know, for uh, strategic cover points and uh, little hints and tips and things like that on each map. Uh, but I have run out of time on this one. So if you'd like to see more, just uh, just put it in the comments below. I'm just going to finish on a couple of hints and tips now from uh, three of my favourite YouTube commentators. Uh, so I'll leave you with that. Hope you enjoyed it. Thanks a lot. Bye. So the first one is actually from Oshi7. Um, I saw this trick. Um, in one of his later videos I thought it was just actually going to slam straight into it but lo and behold if you keep low enough um, for, for you pilots who like to, to stay really close to the ground uh, if you keep low enough there's a lock on you you can actually smash through them without getting blown up. Now I didn't know that nice little tip. Now this second one I'm not 100% sure on who it was who did it. I think it was uh, the squirrel's nuts um, I'm sure that somebody will, will put me right uh, otherwise. But yeah, if you stay away from the lampposts, the lampposts are still hard and solid. But these um, these little light posts here, these could be clipped. Just like that. So it saves you. Uh, it saved my ass a few times coming down roads and things like that where I, uh, I kind of just clip them. And uh, luckily it saved my ass. Uh, people don't. Some people don't like it, but I think it's an added bonus for chopper pilots. Something else not to worry about.